In the early days of 2024, officers were patrolling when they saw a woman waving her hands toward them. When they stopped, the woman told them that a man in a black SUV had rear-ended her car and fled the scene. Okay. So what? What's the deal? So the intersection back there, right, yeah. uh, right before Wendy's, I, I can see a traffic stop woman waving her hands. Yeah. Um, this guy, basically, she was she was stopping. He was doing, yeah. Stay there. Stay there. Yeah. So she was waving, and then the traffic was stop right there by the uh, public, and then he, he just took out. So I'm glad they were both okay. Uh, male, female couple in there, and then this dude was just all in. Where'd he hit him with? Uh, it was like a rear end. Okay. Okay. And you ran into somebody? I into it. I didn't. It wasn't hard. That's right. But you can't, you can't leave. Well, you can't leave. 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 You Ten fifty. It's going to be southbound. Now marker forty-seven. So yeah, signal three. It's going to be on US one. Do you have a driver's license? Where's the expired seat? Okay. You got insurance on this? I do. I got it. I can't even get the money now. You got registration? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell it. Please don't. I've got all my belongings right Bud, you can't drive it. I'm not going to do it. You're going to have to get all your stuff out. I've got somebody coming to get it. Please don't. No. No. I, you got no insurance. I'm not letting anybody drive it. You're involved in the, in the hit and run. So, nope. We're not doing it. Huh? I don't, I don't care. I got people... I got a guy who says you hit somebody. No, he back, but I didn't. It was at the light. I was stopped. I think he backed into me. I never took my foot off the brake. I swear to you. Okay, I don't care. If they, if they want something, yeah, I'm, I'm telling the car, okay? But nobody drive it. I do, I do, I do. I got somebody. I'll get nope, nope, you don't have insurance. I do have okay. insurance. Liberty Mutual. I you told me you don't have insurance. No, no, I do. I just, I can't get into my email. It is oh. mine. And I just, I just got locked out of my Gmail account. It does have insurance for Liberty Mutual. That is for sure. I can get somebody here. Okay, right. I got that proof. Nope. So let me see. Let me see if I can find it. Let's see if somebody's called this in. I have, so far, I haven't heard anything on the radio. Okay. Uh, there was somebody else there. Uh, they, 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 just, are, they, are they going to report it? I didn't stop to talk to them. I just wanted to get out of them. Yeah. Hey, it's FHP. FHP. Do you, you have, have a, a uh, report of a uh, hit and run, run at the 50? Nothing on my screen, but not that I want to call for a minute. Okay. And I don't have any units that look like in that area. 
Okay, I got a report from a, I think it was a U.S. Marshal. Said somebody flagged him down to 50. And somebody hit him and took off. And then he pointed out the vehicle and I pulled him over, so I got him here. No, the U.S. Marshal, whoever gave you that info, did not call us, and I don't want yeah. to with that information either. Yeah, he's, he's going back to try and find the victim. Okay. So, we don't know where it happened at exactly at the 15th? I think it happened at the light there at um, uh, Sombrero. Okay. As he said, he was at the light when it happened. Weird. And they didn't pull that Yeah, well, I think he, they did a little bit of damage, but this guy admits to having a crash. But if I don't have a victim, I can't charge him with it. Right. So, I need that. I would call that Marshall back and say he found him because. Yeah, he's going to look for him now, so. Okay. Okay. What are they calling it to? I guess they're in town or wherever. They're from my mom's house in Ramrod. But I got them. I get called out from the dirty woods. I don't know where it's at. I'm going to call my own car right now. Huh? Well, cancel them. Why? Because... I was there. I was there. Let me explain something to you. You're driving without a license. Right. So, I can take you to jail. I can see your car because you have nobody to tow to, to drive it. I'm not going to wait for someone to come all the way from Anchor. I got tow cuts here to come a lot quicker. I'm not going to be here all day. Okay? You can go get it out of the tow yard. You, let me explain something to you. You can't drive. So you can go get her drive to the license too, then you're going to have to get a truck out. Because you're going to have to get a tow there anyway from somebody else. Now you got to pay another tow to start driving. So, you know, we're not, we're not going to play games here. Okay? Hello? You shouldn't have run from that, that crash. Yeah. I'm here with the SAC and I need you to tell me if you can't do it, so I was going to get you guys to come get my vehicle for the clothes and I'm going to Hello? Hey, Trooper, this is Carolina. Dispatch, your victim is going to be at the Barracuda Grill in a white Sparrow. Okay. They just called 911. I appreciate it. All right. Thank you, sir. I'll show you a route from where? Well, I'm going to be down here for a while at the 47. Um, at the 47? Because I've, okay. I've got the okay. suspect here. So. All right. Um, I can send one of my guys, if you want, to go stand with the Barracuda Grill people. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm having some trouble with him right now, but... Do you want me to send your routine backup? Yeah, so we can find out what's going on with him. He's got some weird stuff going on. What kind of vehicle do you have? It's a, um, oh, it's an SUV. It looks like a, I'm not sure what it is. Might be a Toyota. Uh, let me see what it is here. I'm not sure. I don't even think the tag goes to it. Oh, okay. I'll get you something on the way. Okay. All right. Thanks. Thank you. Okay. So you don't have any personal insurance, right? What's that? I might leave my bag in the bag as I get out and look. You can get out and look. You can get out and look. Because I don't want to need it for the crash. They just reported it. So let's figure it out.
Oh, you got an address? You got a local address here? Yeah. What is it? Well, my mom was, I don't know the address where we're moving to is up here, but um, 27367. Cayman, Cayman. K-A-Y-M-A-N? Yeah, that's Ramrock. Three three zero four two. Four two. Okay, what's your name? Christine? N A N N E? Okay. L I N G A R D. Lindard? You got a date of birth? 684. And you got a um, uh, driver's license in Tennessee? You're out of Tennessee or where? That's a Florida. You're out of Florida? Yeah. Okay. Just hang out here for a minute. Let I find out who you are. You said you're just expired, that's it? That's out of Florida. C-H-R-I-S-T-I-N-E. Last name is L-I-N-D-A-R-D. G-A-R-D. Good. You've been arrested before? Behind him? No, right there. Right. They're going to the airport. That's following Okay. So, who, who's, hang on, who are you? Okay. okay, so you're a witch. I didn't see you actually. I want to show you the lady that I pulled up next to. Uh, okay. Alright. Yeah, okay. Okay, you're driving the car. Okay. Alright, and what, what happened? Okay. Okay. Which lane were you in? Left lane, right lane? Right next to the left turn lane. So you were in the inside lane? Okay. Okay. So you were stopped? Yes. Yeah. At the light? Okay. the red light. Okay. Waiting for the light to turn green, and then all of a sudden you feel... Were you wearing your seatbelt? Yeah. You were wearing your seatbelt. Okay. Do you see the vehicle that hit you? Yeah. Did you see the driver? Yeah, he got out after... Okay. Let me get him. Just stay right here. I'll get him out. Just give me a thumbs up. Ooh. Stand over here. Okay, play him. How, how fast were you going? I was at the stoplight. We were stopped. You were stopped yeah. at the stoplight. Yeah. And how fast were you going before? 35, 40. We were completely stopped. We were completely stopped. So about... I don't know if he backed into me or my foot okay. off the brake. I don't, okay. I don't know, but we were stopped and all of a sudden I felt boom. I was talking to her. Okay. And were you wearing your seatbelt? Yes. Yeah. Was uh, she wearing her seatbelt? Yes. Oh, it's uh, Okay. Okay, um, get back in the truck. Okay. All right, you guys can go ahead and get out. Um, you can get your stuff out. You got somebody to pick it up? He's back there, the guy that has the dog. Okay. Go ahead and get out, get it what you want out.
person to take that with him. What all you got to get out? Everything? It's all my belongings. That's my whole life. That's all you get it out and put it right there? What are you going to leave in there? Uh, I got to talk fast about it. Well, you got to talk fast, because I'm not going to be here all day. I got to get this cash report done and, and get out of here, okay? Put that down. Can you get you put your hands behind your back? I'm placing you under arrest for driving with an expired or with a revoked license knowingly and also hit and run. Okay, you understand that? Okay, come on back here. Uh, 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 Tip for a good run there, so uh, driving us suspended. Okay, come over here. Okay. Hang on. Okay. You got anything on the attic you need to know about? Speak to a lawyer for advice before 
questioning and to have him or her with you during questioning. If you cannot afford a lawyer, one will be appointed to you to represent you before any questioning, if you wish. If you decide to answer without a lawyer present, you will have the right to stop answering at any time. You can decide to, at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. You have the right to stop answering at any time uh, until you speak to a lawyer also. Do you understand these rights by explaining yes. to you? Has anybody previously requested uh, any, any law enforcement officer to allow you to speak with a lawyer? Have you asked a... a Previously requested any law enforcement no. officer. Okay. I was a, I was actually a, a CI, a paid informant in Tennessee. Okay. So with these rights in mind, do you wish to speak to me now? Sure. Okay. Um, what's in the, the the thing with the green fluorescent? The MSM bag. It's MSM. It's from when I worked up there. I worked at a horse stable. Green fluorescent. At the baggage? No, the liquid. Oh, antifreeze. Antifreeze. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. Yeah, it's it's actually the real thick concentrated stuff okay. I got from a buddy yep. that works at a truck stop. Okay. So it's like 100% antifreeze. Okay, and then you got the the big bag of That's stuff. That's vitamin horse vitamins. Horse vitamins. Yeah, it's where I work at a stable muck and stalls. Okay. I bought it and just it was been in the truck for a long yeah, time. Yeah, what about the little clear baggie? The little clear baggie. That's from a long time ago. I had a drug problem. Um, okay, so what is it? Uh, it's probably cocaine or okay. uh, maybe Molly, but okay. I've been off a of dope for like six, okay. seven months now. Anything else in the car? No, sir. I wasn't even sure that, I didn't even know that baggie was in there. Okay. If I'd have known that, I've tried to clean it out several times, but you see how it is. Yeah. We've been living in it for the past month or so, okay. and everything just kind of got thrown in there. I did have another guy riding with me, and my truck got searched not long ago and they found in his bag a syringe a little baggie with hair uh okay. heroin residue in it yes some troll boy in there too it shouldn't have been okay, there oh is. That, that must have been his i haven't done smoke crack in over a year i've been trying to get my life together okay but I, there's another dude that i brought down from tennessee he's now in fort lauderdale at a halfway house named aaron goins all right. Want to come to anything else in there? There, there shouldn't be anything else in there. You sure? I'm pretty sure, yeah. Positive. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I've looked through there. There might be, uh, I think in the center console, I've seen the end, uh, just a little cap off a syringe, but there ain't no syringes. There's no pipes. There's no dope in there. I've gone through it a bunch of times. Okay. That, the, most of those clothes are actually Aaron's, and that's probably where that baggie came from. They're mostly Aaron's? Yeah. That's the guy that was in with you? Yeah. Okay. He kind of bailed out and left all this stuff. Is he down me. here? He's in Fort Lauderdale at a halfway house. Okay. I mean, I know his whole name, Aaron McKay Goins. Um, okay. I don't know what halfway house he's at. Um, first choice or something like that. He's working in a phone room in um, Dania Beach. Uh, the halfway house is in Lauder Hill. Okay. Um, right. Am I getting charged with the baggie or? Mm -hmm. Well, see. Uh, I, I mean, I, I apologize, sir. The only reason I left is I got scared. But okay. I, I do now, have Now, let's go back to the crash. All right. Okay. So you pulled up behind these people. I pulled up. I stopped. We're okay, you stopped. stopped. The light was right. red. So uh, then somehow you went I turned, I turned and, and talked and was saying something to her, and mm -hmm. I don't know if my foot slipped off the brake. If he backed into me, I don't know. Okay. I didn't feel the truck rolling. Okay. All I felt was bam. And then okay. he jumped out and says, oh, we got to call the cops. Yeah. I mean, I've lived down here before. For and what did you say to him after that? I was like, please don't. I don't. My license is not good. Please yeah. don't until we can work this out. Yeah. I mean, and he said, oh, no, there's damage. Which there might have been a little paint. So well, there's damage. There's more than paint. Hey there. Yeah. There wasn't. There was a black scuff on the back of that. Well, that yeah, but that's, that's, he's, he's got, he's got, they got to replace that bumper. So, see, I, see, I, there's it, ain't, no way, it ain't scratch paint. There's no way that where the way I was sitting and where he was, okay. that even if I foot slipped off the brake, would have hit him that hard. All right. He had to have backed into me. So then what happened? I left. You left? Did yeah. you tell him you were leaving? I said, yeah, I'm going. Okay. And he was, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't. Right. But the way they jumped out of the car, it was almost like it was set up, you know, as... Not like somebody said, but like they backed into me or something. Cause they uh, I don't know wrong. what the reason would be, but. I don't either. I mean, but okay. the damage on the front of my truck had been there. Okay. And you can see that I got uh, on the, the light, somebody hit it with a oh. golf club in Tennessee. I got that 
like okay. the JB weld on it. Okay. The, the light was already busted. Okay. Um, all that. All right, anything else? No. All right. Hang up. I know that. Well, I suspended the yeah. load. Okay, so. I'm just saying, if it helps me with the bond being lower, having my local ID. No, because it actually hurts you. Yeah, they're all. And I'm going to see about another charge on that. Possibly. Oh, please don't, man. Well, when did you get suspended or go to uh, when I went to Tennessee, I believe. So you went to Tennessee. Yeah. Were you, then you went to Tennessee or otherwise? Yes, and then I got noticed that it was suspended while I was up there. Okay. And... You can't really run a marathon. So I know. I don't know what I was thinking, on. man. I just got spooked and was. Mm -hmm. And I apologize. There ain't no way to put these in the front. I got a bad shoulder from an injury. No, I can't put them in the front. I'm just in a lot of pain. I'm about to feel like I'm gonna throw up. It hurts. Okay. I don't like. Is it just a shoulder? If I put another pair on there and loosen them up a little bit? Yeah. That yeah, that would help. All right. Sit back. Okay, you want to do it? Yeah, we do, do it that way. Yeah, it's better. Too bad. Thank you. Put your seatbelt on. Just meeting the crash because I'm a bad driver. Uh, you grew up down here? Yeah, I've been, I grew up on, we moved here when I was nine years old. Oh, man. That was, so that was like what year? 91, 92. Okay. Hang on a second. Ready? Oh, hold your pants up. Yeah, can you grab my hat for him? Oh, uh, It's going to stay. Although the man was taken to jail, the charges are still unknown. However, since he was cooperative with the officers, they must have been lenient with him. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and click on the one on the screen now for more.